I know if you're like me, you recognize that we are constantly at war with the enemy. He is a liar. He is a deceiver. And we have many weapons at our disposal. The main one, as far as I can tell, is being the Word of God. I put off the lies of the enemy with the truth of God's Word. Psalm 17:8 says, Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me in the shadow of your wings. When we speak of our children or our grandchildren, we often say they're the apple of my eye. That's the most precious thing we can say. That's the most prized place. That is what God thinks of us. When the enemy comes against me and tries to make me doubt God's love, I just immediately think, no, I'm the apple of his eye. His word says so. Then hide me in the shadow of thy wings. What does that mean? Well, like a mother hen brings her brood under her wings where nothing can get to them. Uh, Proverbs 18.10 says, The name of the Lord is a strong, mighty tower where the righteous can run and be safe. Those are the wings of the Lord. His character, His nature. He is our peace. He is our provider. He is our victory. He is our shepherd. He is present with us. He is our righteousness. He is our holiness. He is our healer. He is our all in all. I've been thinking about this song, uh, my goodness, over the past week. And it was written, I believe, received in 1988 or 1989. And uh, I believe it's for somebody out there right now. When the storms begin to blow, there is one place that I know that I can go and I go
Father, help us to be diligent to God over our hearts and our minds with all diligence. For out of it flow the streams of life, living water, you. We need you today. Help us to take captive our thoughts and hide our souls deeply within the shadow of your wings, keeping us as the apple of your eye. We love you so much, Lord. Thank you for loving us.